When you're using the technique of the physics forceps, we are, as we've mentioned before, putting rotational pressure and tension on the PDL, which is breaking down and, and eventually the tooth will, will move. You have to take your time. It may take a minute or two or even longer on some roots. And as you're rotating your wrist, you will actually feel the PDL pop. The, it, it will literally pop. Now at that point you can stop using the physics forcep because the PDL is, is pretty much disturbed. And what I will often do is, is take a forcep or a needle nose um, a forcep or pliers and grab onto the tooth and then just simply rotate it out. You don't want to necessarily keep rotating um, say a cuspid tooth because you potentially could do damage to the tissue or tear the tissue or um, maybe even the bone.